Hello everyone, and welcome to the first episode of Talon School. Uh, in this lesson we'll look at Talon's most frequent combos, and we'll look at his bread and butter combo in lane, his insta-kill combo, and his uh, another team fighting combo, because you can use the insta-kill combo for team fighting as well. Now, you can also, I'm also going to show just quickly before we begin, how you create your own combo because it's very easy to just chain in your own combo and kind of improvise. What you want to look at when you make a combo with Talon is uh, the speed of the combo, the accuracy of the combo, and the damage efficiency. That is, how fast the combo is, how easy it is to hit because sometimes um, you can position yourself quite awkwardly for a W and they can sometimes move away if you do it too slowly, etc and the damage efficiency. Now damage efficiency is how well it utilizes uh, Talon's E and passive. Now one quick thing to note here is that it's only the actual basic auto attack portion of Talon's Q that gets enhanced by Mercy. The amplified Q, that is the extra damage from the Q, does not get amplified once more by Mercy. Now your bread and butter uh, combo in lane is going to be E auto attack Q W. This is a very flexible combo as it lets you wait a bit before using W and it gets the amplified auto attack and it lets you reset Q and is also very fast. It's very comfortable to be able to use a W afterwards as they're running away as oftentimes you'll, you'll find an awkward situation where you're standing on top of the enemy and you hit half of your W and they move away. But this, when you, once you've mastered the um, auto attack reset with Q, this is going to be a very comfortable and accurate combo to use in lane. Your fast assassination combo is going to be E, auto attack, and Q to reset the auto attack, R, and then Tiamat slash W. Now first of all, the Tiamat slash W, theoretically it's better to use Tiamat first, as um, in the time it takes you for the animations, they might move away, or they will move away a little bit, which causes your Tiamat to do slightly less damage, but I'm gonna go ahead and say that you can use whichever you feel most comfortable with because the, d the difference is not very big. Other than that, I don't think there's very much to say about this. Um, this is the combo used to deal as much damage as possible as fast as possible, um, but it also means that you, you're not playing with stealth, you're not utilizing stealth, or you don't have any escape afterwards. After this combo, you're kinda sitting duck. But it's fast, and it's powerful. Now a combo that doesn't make you a sitting duck is E, auto attack, Q, and then TM at W into ultimate. This is the combo you use when you know you can kill the enemy AD carry uh, instantly and then you want to get out. Uh, use the 2.5 second stealth to get out of the, uh, the fight. This is generally you know, just your escape combo, because this is the only one that lets you save your ultimate for last so you can escape safely. These are the basic combos with Talon. Now you can experiment and create your own, but if you're only using these ones you'll still be fine. In the next lesson we'll talk about stealth and how to effectively utilize your stealth, what the benefits are, and how you can play around with it. So yeah, thank you very much for watching, I'll see you next time. Peace.